Greetings YouTube, welcome back to the channel. I want to start off this video by saying that I, and this isn't going to shock people, was a moron, was an idiot. For years, whenever the new arena hit, especially the six star shard arena, you had to grind, especially when there's 14 days involved, millions upon millions of points. And so I didn't even look at the rewards. I just jumped straight in and put up 500,000 and thought, okay, I'm probably about one sixth of the way there. And I was like, okay, 5,000 points, 15,000 points, 30,000 points. Boy, this is really, really easy. 50,000, 70,000, no, 90,000, what? 110,000? And then I got down to about here as I claimed these, and I realized I just put up over 300,000 more points than I had to. And here I was thinking I was going to have to put up 3 or 4 million, because that's what it's been in the past. Kabam completely buffed this thing. And it's, it's for 2,000, 3,000, 4,000, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9... Yeah, a full six-star basic worth of six-star shards, 10,000. For just minuscule, that's 200,000 points. Compare it to the five-star one, which is also 200,000. It's the same amount of matchups for five-stars as it is for six-stars. And notice, there are not six-star shards here, and there are not units here. So I'm still going to do it because I'm a arena addict moron. But at the same time, like, if you can only do one, obviously do the six-star shard celebration. And I had 31 matchups, which is nothing. I only probably needed, like, 20, maybe even less than that. So whenever I make a pro Kabam video like this, almost nobody watches it. Why? Because, you know, if you think of my channel as some hater of Kabam who just loves to be critical and spread lies about clickbait, blah, 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 blah. And this video isn't going to match your preconceived notions about my channel. It's not going to be confirmation bias, as they say in research. But Kabam deserves a ton of credit for listening to the community here. Because they just shrank those milestones so much that even people who hate the arena, and Lord knows there's a lot of them out there and a reason for there to be a lot of them out there. Can't hate on this. Can't do it. And I'm thankful that I'm in a position to promote it. Because starting this year, I thought I was not going to make another YouTube video. And 2023 was going to be where I rode off into the sunset on my metaphorical horse and saluted this amazing community and this channel. And I decided, sort of like quitting the game versus going to a semi-retired or retired alliance, I would just step back and play when I could, not rush to record things that were newsworthy that I couldn't get to right away. And it's it's been a tremendous blessing on my mental health. And what I've learned is that, yeah, I might make thousands of dollars less on YouTube now, but I'm happier. I'm not on the hamster wheel. And I still get to see amazing legends who come by to say hello or still even sometimes donate which is incredibly generous on live streams and in other capacities so i'm very blessed and i feel blessed to have this six star shard celebration be so buffed especially with 14 days i mean you could do a fight a day and be fine at this rate so yay kabam let's keep this video under five minutes as we try to do when we can on this channel and not have triple the ads or whatever youtube now throws in front of videos like this thank you kabam thanks for watching have a good one